look, this is my life, and it's a battle within. I gotta survive, even if I'm sinning the wind. And if I show no remorse, I reap the devil's reward. He said, it, Give me riches, but I'm looking for more. When I was young, witness my dad standing for right. Black pride in him, even though he passed for white. Took years of my life, now I'm missing the man. Mom's on some other shit, now I'm missing the plan. So I'm stuck in this fucking remote. All the lessons to a young teen, nigga, was gone. Did my pimpin' ass off and put me up on the game. It really ain't no love, it's about this paper, man. Put me in a position, got me out on a mission. Collected from the hoes, turn me on to my pimpin'. A nigga from Memphis dealing with life as a struggle. This is the gift I was given, so I just live by my hustle. Big bad Buddha, baby. You know how we do it. So what's up? How's everybody doing? Good, I hope. Um, today, um, I wanted to come and uh, tell uh, all my girls that it's been like, let me see, a night, a good two weeks that I haven't smoked. Um, well, I've been home for almost. So it's been three weeks, as a matter of fact. I'm like so proud of myself. It's, yeah, like I said, it's been a good three weeks, almost three weeks that I haven't smoked. Um, I've always wanted to know if anybody wants to come along for the ride with me. That would make me so happy, make me feel so special. Um, I got my girl Jamie along with the ride with me. Um, you guys know Jamie from my, uh, from the lives and um, yeah, she's awesome. She's, Jamie's known me for a cool little minute. Um, she's cool, she's faithful, she's she's everything that I want in a dark heart. Um, and that's how you, it being like her, are gonna get on my good side and get my videos that I have all listed. Um, the ones that are really private to my life. Um, you know how, you know, a few, very few have them. Very few have them all. I think like two of them, two people have. Like all the videos were, um, you know, where, you know, where I have, you have total access to my whole channel, um, because I tell some pretty crazy stories, um, but even crazier ones on the ones that are all listed. So, um, yeah, if you want to get in on it, you, you gotta be faithful like that, because <laughs> I just don't let just anybody into my dark heart. That shit started getting in my mind. In my mind. Yeah, man, man. Always gotta get up on my mind. Why did they gotta get up on my mind? I gotta leave that shit on my back. On my mind. Gotta leave that shit in the city riders. Um, the, the people that, you know, have, that have been with me for a minute, cool minute, and that are faithful, and they're just awesome. Um, I want you guys, but, uh, you know, rewind. Uh, but I want everybody, that, whether you've been with me for a long time or been with me for a week, you've been with me for two days, whatever, I want you all to come along with me and stop smoking. Because, you know what, like I said on my live uh, tonight, where was it yesterday? I'm not getting mixed up with days. But, um, shit gets real. When they start to talk about extracting your lung, shit gets real, real fast. Yeah, um, I just decided, you know what, enough, no more, no more smoking, uh, I can't do it no more. Yeah, I be tipping, tipping, twisting up two blunts, yeah, I be rolling, rolling, pop a couple pills, yeah, I be high as fuck, I'm high, I'm high. Yeah, I be high as fuck, sipping on that syrup. Yeah, I be tipping, tipping, twisting up two blunts. Yeah, I be rolling, rolling, pop a couple pills. Yeah, I be high as fuck, I'm high, I'm high. Yeah, I be high as fuck. Pass the bud, I got the blunt. Give it a touch and twist it up. Smoking. I uh, it's hard. I'm cranky. I'm a bitch. I'm a fucking bitch. Fuck you, bitch. But um, I just. You know what, I have to for if I'm going to be here, you know, if I want to stay here for a while longer. I want more than uh, 20 years, you know, I don't want another 40. 
and see if you know I'm able to have to get that out of my you know because I've been through a lot and my body's been through a lot so let's see if I can make it anyway so I decided to you know what um, um, I'm so happy to be alive that I'm going to tell a couple of stories a few like two or three stories about me almost dying Jesus Christ I have been through some shit as you guys know um I have been through the ringer <laughs> you know what I'm saying Jeez, you know um I've been through hell and back um and um I just want to tell a couple of stories about some times when I almost died um and actually I had to get my girl Betty to actually you know tell me because I've been through so much that some things feel like dreams and I'm just like I told her Betty did this really happen or am I tripping and she goes no bitch it really happened yeah. I waking up in the morning yeah my mouth is really yawning but I know when I'm off for fucking get out the bed I'm a bro take a toe yeah I'm on a stroll to another realm can't you tell I'm a fucking need another way out me and my girl Bettina, uh, see, because some things are like dreams, um, and uh, they feel uh, like a dream, you know, like, because when you're drunk and like intoxicated, like it, it comes up later on that you weren't dreaming, you know, um, I told her one day, I was like, Betty, did we ever get in a car accident? You know, we were driving with some dudes and somebody ran us over off the fucking freeway. I was like, because I'm having like, you know, flashbacks or like nightmares or, or something. I don't know. She goes, no, it really happened. I was like, for real? She goes, yeah. I was like, so we sat there, we talked for a while, and uh, we were with these dudes, and uh, we were, uh, I remember I was, I was with one of them, I, w I was kicking back in the back seat with him, and she was sitting right here by me, she had a boyfriend named Bobby, so she always had a boyfriend named, she always had Bobby, you know what I'm saying, so she was never, like, with us for you know, it was always like me and some somebody and like another girl and her, but she would never met, you know, because she always had Bobby. Bobby's dead now. God rest his soul. He was awesome. He was beautiful. Um, such a fun, loving soul. But that's another story. <laughs> and uh, um, so we were party we were having a time of our lives um i don't even know the guy's name to be honest um it, you know what i think kathy was there another girl not kathy the one i put in all my stories let me tell you about kathy kathy isn't her real name okay um that's the name i use for her but there was a girl named kathy with us that night yep um she was from the war zone and, uh, yeah, she, but it wasn't, like, because the girl Kathy I always talk about, she has another name, but I can't use her name for privacy reasons. And plus, I still talk to her, and I love her to this day. Yeah, my homegirl Kathy, she was awesome, but that's another story. <laughs> um, the girl that we were with that night, her name was Kathy as well. Um, she was, um... The homeboy's girlfriend. Um, Big Pat. Yes, Big Patrick. Um, but that didn't stop her from being with somebody else that night because she was in the front, in the middle, with another guy, one of the guys we were with. <laughs> Sorry, Big Pat. <laughs> but um, yeah, she was. <laughs> and uh, so we were going, and. Um, I don't even know what happened. I know one minute we were partying out a good time, and then these people, um, we started racing with them. We we're on the freeway, and the guy that was driving, he was fucking drunk. We were all drunk. And uh, from what Betty tells me, we were driving, and these people started to, like, 
we're racing with him because this guy had like a muscle car. The guy we were with, he had like some kind of like, I don't know, Camaro or something, I don't know. But the people that we're, that we're racing with, they were like, we were going with them. And then all of a sudden, like they, like, we're like, kind of doing this to us. And the, uh, the guy that was driving, he got, I guess, scared. And we fucking, uh, we hit the wall. We hit, we hit it, boom! Fucking, we flipped, like, I don't know how many times. Um, there's um, a little piece of skin right here, in your, right here, like in between there. Um, the, people, the kids are piercing it these days. Um, I don't have that piece of skin. Um, mine is torn because when I, we got in that accident, it tore it and that's why I was bleeding. And um, it's just dang. It still kind of dangles there. Um, I can feel it. It's torn. Um, there's a little piece of it like on top that's connected. But uh, yeah, I don't have that piece of skin no more. Um, oh shit, my fucking widow just laid eggs. That shit, holy shit balls! Wow, she was pregnant. She was pregnant. I'm going to be a grandma. I'll show you that a little bit. <laughs> um, but yeah, we had a. I remember we went to the hospital. We went. Some people took us. The the ambulance came with for the guys because the guys were really badly hurt. And uh. We went in, from what I remember, I remember being in the hospital, I remember crying. And I remember bleeding, and I, my nose was bleeding, and my my mouth was bleeding. And, um, Kathy was hurt, with her, her, where her leg was, um, fucked up. Like, her calf, like, she hit her, like, her calf right there. I remember them bringing in the guy that I was knocking. Um, it's leg was all twisted like the bottom of it like it was all turned and I just looked at him and he's the one that antagonized the people that we were racing with he's the one that fucking was talking shit out the window um and he just like looked at us like he was mad like and I remember the driver came in and he was busted the fuck up the driver was fucked off he had, his whole fucking face was fucked up, um, I remember, um, his thing in his hands was all, like, twisted, like, the guys got really badly hurt, um, I don't know how they got so hurt, um, but I remember the driver was telling us, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, the one I was with, though, he didn't have nothing to say, um, he had absolutely, he was mad because his leg was fucked up. Um, he didn't have like nothing to say. Like I, I, I didn't want to talk to him. At first, he was like, uh, he like tried to like. He's all, he, he's all, hey, he's all, come here. And I was all, I was all, I need to get seen. I was all, I said, I'm not trying to fuck with you. I said, just leave me alone. And like that's when he, like, got kind of pissy. And uh, I remember, uh, um, like, I don't know, I, I, I don't remember because I was drunk. But like I remember bits and pieces of it. Uh, I remember my mom and dad showed up with Betty's mom. Betty's mom was pissed. Uh, I remember my mom and dad were mad because my dad could speak perfect Spanish, and uh, Betty's mom is uh, she's Mexicana, and uh, she was uh, she was going off because uh, I remember uh, my dad was telling her, you know what, your daughter uh, isn't exactly an angel either. My dad used to work with Kathy's dad at Loveless Medical Center and uh and Kathy wasn't even supposed to be with us at all so she was like in deep shit and uh let me tell you something about Kathy that fucking bitch she almost, she almost got me killed again that's all I'll get to that in a minute but uh oh my god it was just 
you know, bad situation for such young people to be in, you know, horrible accident. It was, we rolled so many times, we we're lucky to be alive. We we're lucky we weren't ejaculated. Ejaculated? Is that the word you use? <laughs> he thrown from the car. <laughs> Is that the word you use though? Ejaculated from the car? Is that. E no. Oh, ejected. Ejected. <laughs> oh my god. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Ejaculated. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't believe I just said that. Okay, so. Um. You know. Oh my god, it was just horrible, you know? Um. That. Personally, I feel my people is cursed to be riders till eternity. My enemies trying to murder me. Hiders in the infirmary, but I clock my dough verbally. Currently, uh, and then there was another time. Um, I was uh, I was with my we had a gotten into it. I think I had a story with him. I think I have. I'm not exactly sure. I heard this beat, so I had to be first to speak. Helping my rasa seems to be what works for me. Certainly, I got killers doing dirt for free. Burst the heat, cause I never learned to turn my cheek. Um, I remember we had went to a party, a, a Halloween party, and uh, I was not flirting. I don't want to say flirty, I don't want to say flirty. But I had went to the bathroom, and there was, um, I was just like a bunny, or was it a bunny? I don't know, something like trampy, but you know, put ears on basically lingerie, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but anyway, I had went to the bathroom, and there was this guy when I was coming out, and he goes, Oh, bunny. So she tells me. And so I do, you know. Take my book. And. Yeah. Um. We, uh. He fucking, like, runs to the other side of the fucking. What do you call it? And he grabs me. And he fucking. He starts blasting in the air. Carelessly. Okay, um. And they said, motherfucker, there's fucking kids upstairs. Sleep, there's fucking. Oh, oh, oh. He goes, I don't give a fuck. He's all. And he grabs me and he's like, like the whole party's like a standoff and he's just like, all like, just like all crazy. He has me like that. And he's all like fucking. You know, all, all crazy, you know? And I'm just like, you know? So like we're like standing off with these people, you know, that we don't even know. And so we leave, and here I am. We have Kathy, my my friend, you know, my bestie, with us, and we have his fucking homie with us. And we're trying, we're leaving, and then he goes, and he he's like, and I was like, where is fucking, where's Kathy and fucking your homie? And uh, his homie Toker. Well, and you know what? I don't know if, if I use the word. You know what? I always keep it, his real name in the back of my head because I don't want to expose him for who he is. But I always say Toker or, or uh, Smokey or something. I don't know if I say Toker or Smokey. But in the back of my it's something like that. You know, getting high. You know, but I don't want to say it. I'm sure you guys can guess it. But um, So we fucking. Uh, when I we leave and he's like, oh, he feels like, you know, people are like, like, you know, and uh, and one one of the guys says, are you alright, homegirl? Are you alright? Goes, don't fucking talk to my fucking woman. What the fuck's matter with you? 
and uh, he goes, I go to school with her. He goes, don't fuck it. He started to put a gun in my face, and I'm like, stop, stop, fucking just go, man. And fucking, he's all, he, we get in the car, and we're fucking, we jam up, fucking, uh, we're over there by, like, on Riverside Avenue, over there by the South Valley. And we're speeding up there, and he goes, fuck this shit. And fucking, uh, no, no, he, they, they start blasting at us when we're leaving. They start fucking acting, ding, 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 you know, they, they, hitting the fucking car. And I'm just like, holy shit. You know what I'm saying? And fucking, and so he's like, get down. And fucking, he put my head down. And fucking, uh, and, uh, and he's driving up Riverside. And fucking, I'm just like, I'm, I just look at him. And fucking, he just looks at me. He's all, he's all, fuck this shit. He fucking turns around. And fucking, he goes and books right back. Yeah, I know. Oh, you gang you bitches out there. You know you love it. But at the time, I was like, what the fuck are you doing? I was like, oh my god. So we're like, fuck it. <laughs> and then when we get, we're, we turn up fucking bridge. And, uh, no, not up, down. Uh, that way, we go west. And fuck it. And he goes, see, what the fuck you do? This is what you do. And, uh, this is your fault, fucking, and fucking, like, he's all paranoid, he's fucking going up bridge, fucking, like, 90, fucking, what time, cause they're, they're, they come after us, they do, they, a few of them come after us. Yeah, we can do this like gangsters and slug it out, we can do this like punks and punk it out, pull your strap on me, nigga, you better kill me, thug life, baby, I probably be punished for hard living. Nine to the facts, thugs is convicts and God's prison. Hands on the strap, praying so father, please forgive me. But we we got we, we get away and, and I was like, who's catching? Don't give a fuck about that fucking And I'm just like, I'm all crying, you know. And he's like, oh, get the fuck over here, fucking sit by me. And I was like, oh, no, it's a young man. Uh, fucking dumb shit, you know. Fucking dumbass, fucking dumb shit, you know. And, uh, go back and we fucking get them. They're all walking, all sad on bridge. <laughs> oh my god, you know. Yeah, I'm just like, oh my god. So. That's another time your girl must get killed. Um, and then, um, what other time is there? There's a few of them. Jeez, like, for real. Um, Look at my sister siding with my baby's mammy Like she can't stand me, sick family Be the first to turn so petty handy Feeling me to my granny, celebrate the Grammy Damn, we wanna do no planning Was so perfect, all of my damn me oh, Never forget the bomb Trippin' on foster home, saying I wasn't manly With a squad of love, but I keep my skeletons under One that, you know, kind of hits closer to home. Um, this guy, uh, it's, it's, I can't say his real name because I don't want, you know, his fucking mom and them to get mad at me because uh, he's dead. Um, this hits, like, hard for me. Uh, I think this is the first time I've ever spoken about it. Um, 
it was, it was hot outside. It was very hot. And I remember I was wearing, my mom still has these clothes, as a matter of fact. Um, my mom has a storage, um, and uh, she keeps all things in there that are old, nostalgic, you know. She has like baptismal suits. And anyway, I asked her to hold this piece of clothing for me. Um, they're uh, size 7 white shorts and uh, a striped top. It's when, uh, you know, Mariah came out with again the Daisy Duke shorts. Uh, it was, yeah, I looked, I looked alright, you know. Uh, still wearing, you know, I was feeling real cute in them. Um, I don't know, we were cruising. We're on Central. And, uh, we, um, this is like the worst things that ever happened to me. Like, the worst. This is gang violence at its worst. I, uh, <laughs> it's kind of hard to talk about. Um, we were, we were kicking back and he we were with his friends. And we had gone, because he stole me away from his friend. Um, it was a bad place to be in, you know. Um, it, half of them were on his side, half of them were on the, on the other guy's side. Um, it, it was, you know, it was a fucked up situation to be in. But, uh, I remember he had, uh, we went cruising that night and, uh, we were chilling and, uh, we seen them, you know, I'm not going to say who or, or what, but which videos, you know, because it's, I don't want to start a gang war here again, you know. But, uh, they were go. we seen them, like, cruise up and down, like, three times, and we knew that they were getting, either going to bang or something worse. Shut up, kitty. And, uh, so they went up. Again, uh, uh, Good Central Avenue between Coors and Trisco was the strip where we used to cruise. Um, and this happened like on 47th, I think. There's like a garage place right there. And we were parked right there. This is when we used to kick back and drink on the side. And it was bumper to bumper. Like, it was such an amazing place to be on a weekend for kids like us. This is before they banned cruising. Um, this is when everybody in the grandma had a little rider. Um, it was nice. My boy, my boy had a fucking mote. Uh, we were, uh, he had like a '76 mote. It was beat up, you know what I'm saying? But it was still his, and he was fixing it. And uh, we had, uh, we knew it was gonna go down. He goes. Baby, you know, give me a beer. And, uh, those are the last words that he would ever speak to me. I don't know if they're their last words ever. Um, all of a sudden, I, I knew they were coming. I knew it. I knew it. I seen them. And, like, I was just, like, I was just watching them. And, and I, I was, like, you know, just kind of just... You know, just ignore it. Maybe it'll go away kind of thing. Maybe it'll just pass again. I remember his homeboy, the big tall one. He, he said, you know, what? Well, this is motherfucking... You know? Uh, this is our territory. Fucking fuck. Fucking hell. All of a sudden, you fucking just hear it spraying. You hear the bullets everywhere. 
I just like bent down and I got inside the car and I was just like that. You hear fucking bottles busting. You hear fucking cars getting the fuck out of there. I get out of, the, out of the car and I'm just like, and I go and I see my dude, he was on the fucking ground. And I was like, and then fucking his homie, his best homie was like, the same one that was yelling, acting a fool. He was all, yo, Tony, take care of him. And uh, I noticed he, that he was bleeding, the one that told me to take care of him. And I was like, oh my god, I said, here. And he's all like, take care of him. And I was like, I said, okay, and I fucking bent down. And I put, I got his head and I was like, I, I didn't know what to do. Like, he was bleeding. And uh, so I, I looked right there and it was, he had a shot right here. And I thought that's where the blood was coming from. I didn't know. And these girls pulled up. They said, hey, and because they, they took my car to go look, you know, go run after them. And uh, there was like three or four cars that were parked, the dudes were with. Uh, there was, uh, there was a front back Ruby that saw me had. And there was a couple other cars there with the same people that were with. And uh, we had a... These girls pulled up to me and they said, she, they're all giving up and I was like, help me please. Boom, boom, all you gonna hear when we drop lyrical bombs Not me fussy suckers, you don't wanna with our squad Nine the yards, twelve gators, twenty twos and forty fours Only thing missing, camouflage, and we can start the war Kick it down the door, hit you while you up in your bitch Your body flies in all directions, no women, no kids Ain't that poor, I ain't rich, I die trying spit in each word With the wisdom given, I don't fucking lie Step in line, be the first to die, be the first to rise Cry when you find out that you gang banging some down Hit it quick, hit him in the hip Saw home gang, extend the clip Set trip, traps getting lit Like a cigarette, getting trapped in a web Stuck in say, break your leg Little monkey rolling deep Midnight creep, step into me You know it gets steep Talk is cheap, rats getting beat Running to the cops, you need to stop snitching One block, two shots, three shots drop the cabin So we get him and we put him in the car And he's like moaning and I'm just like and then I, I fucking put my hand in the back of his head, like right here. And like, have you guys ever fallen and like, you know, you, f you put your hand on your knee and you can feel your muscles moving, like when you fall? That's what it felt like, uh, but on a much grander scale. And then I had veins all over me, um, all over my lap, brain. Um, it, it looked like uh, little pieces of lasagna, I guess. I don't know how else to describe it. Um, yeah, um, we get to the hospital and I knew he was gonna die. Um, I stayed with him all night. Um, and mom was there holding his hand. And it seemed like every time I went to the bathroom, um, <laughs> every time I come back, his eyes would be more black under. Um, I, uh, I went to the bathroom, um, pee, and I, I noticed like there was like this little piece of something, look at right here, it was like scratching my, my, my belly and it was stuck and it, I found out it was a piece of his skull. A little piece of whatever it was, part of his skull. 
This is sick to execution, thought you knew it I'm a bullet, mm. I'm a throttle, no tomorrow Now your mind is through the truth is I'm full of strength I know, and I, I remember complain. when Nike got shot Ready to gang, bang and slang This is Little Monkey, you already know Keep the lines tight and climb another hook So here we go One clock, two shots, three shots drop Decapitating what I do And I won't ever stop Little Monkey is the name Dead soldier in the game Don't need to bring the vest Cause we all shoot for the brain One clock, two shots, three shots drop Decapitating what I do And I won't ever stop Little Monkey is the name Dead soldier in the game Don't need to bring the best cause we all shoot for the I know that but right by him and I I was gonna kill that night too the guy uh the fuck you looking at nothing bro get the fuck I'm gonna have my face I know you live, bitch. I know you do. I've been put in a lot of compromising positions. Um, you know, right here, my, you know, I've got my throat sliced. There's been many more. Just because my wait, this one alone. Um, I'm lucky to be alive. Um, I love my life. I love being alive. I love life. How can I show you how I feel inside? We outlaws, motherfuckers can't kill my pride. Niggas talk a lot of shit, but that's after I'm gone. Cause they fear me in a physical form. Let it be known I'm troubled. Um, and she got real when they said they were gonna take my lung out. Um, you take advantage what you don't, you what you don't think you you should take. Not advantage, but um, you take for granted what you do every day by yourself. You know, you know that you're doing it. Um, the thing is walking down the street. You know, moving your arm. Um, believe me, I know I'm above arms because I have an abscess that was like that. It was so big. And I was doing drugs. Uh, it was, I was in hell. It was pure fucking hell. Thoughts of my enemies bleed, please. Bust the ass, motherfuckers tried to flee. Pitching me, letting this jump survive. Ran up on his ass when I dumped him down. Cause I'm drunk. you because you're like infected I mean it, eventually you know a couple of my good homegirls you know would help me out make my bed so little things like that getting my tray um, there's nobody to help you in there except for a good few good camaradas you know um, being then on the person that I am you know the old school person I am and people that knew me you know, if I was somebody else I wouldn't have had be fucked nobody wants to have somebody that's all infected you know it's like you're thrown in Nobody wants to fuck with you, you know? I mean, not really, except for the few that are down. Um, you just take advantage. Uh, so, you know, just don't take life for granted. Because you never know when it's going to be taken away from you. Uh, that's what I just wanted to come and say. I wanted to share a couple of things with you. Throw some Boudicca Chronicles in there, you know. 
Um, there's been a lot of, you know, I've been jumped, I've been, you know, beat, stabbed, shanked, sliced, shot at, overdosed, and for what it's worth, I'm still fucking here. Car accidents, um, you know, things, I'm here for something, something greater than, and uh, I don't plan on going nowhere anytime soon. <laughs> so hopefully, you know, um, yeah. I love you guys. You guys have a good one, okay? You guys take care. God bless. Keep them hearts dark, but don't keep them black, fool. You know what time it is. You see any motherfucker with an outlaw on his neck, give him respect or get chin checked. All our enemies getting wrecked. From the tech to the mini 14.